Alright guys, what is up? And today I'm bringing you guys a 34 and 1 hardpoint on Meltdown. Almost forgot the name. Still don't know all the Black Ops uh, maps names yet. There's uh, like the odd one here and there that I uh, get confused with a different map. But uh, other than that, I think I've got them all uh, locked down. Uh, it's surprising. Most of the Call of Duties, I actually know all the maps names before the game even comes out. Just because I find like spoilers or leaks and I just memorize them. I used to be into that stuff so much, like remember all the guns and names before they even come out and all the gun stats before the game even comes out, but uh, I didn't know much going into this game just because I wanted to kind of keep it a surprise and I wasn't even going to quite sure if I was going to enjoy it, but uh, you know, I'm having a really fun time with this game, enjoying it a lot, I'm playing this game a lot, <laughs> when I mean I'm playing it a lot, I'm getting close to 7 days played, which is, you know, maybe not a lot compared to some people and I understand that, but it's at least a lot for me considering I have school every day. But, um, oh, Chris, don't quit that game. <laughs> you guys see me die there, and I uh, hover over a quick game, and I, I do that a lot, but I never actually quit. I don't know why that is. That's like my old Chris Stewart in me, where I used to play solo back in the original Black Ops, and I used to quit games all the time. i get, like, a stupid death, i just leave. So, uh, <clears throat> I used to do that <laughs> quite a bit. Um, I don't know why I still do it. Uh, I don't actually leave the game anymore. I just hover over quick game for, like, a split second. It's like a reflex almost. Uh, I actually haven't been doing it a lot as of late, but uh, I actually I clearly did in this game. But like I said, I've been playing this game a lot, and by the time you're watching this, I'm gonna be tenth prestige. Yes, the big tenth prestige. Not quite prestige master yet, but I am tenth prestige now. And uh, yeah, it's fun being here. Finally, don't have to worry about prestiging anymore. I did hear a rumor though about there's gonna be like four new prestiges I'm not too happy with that uh, I don't really want them to release new prestiges uh, just main reason why is that I just went through 10 uh, I don't feel like going through another um, well actually technically I went through 11 because I reset my stats when I was level 55 and uh, you know <clears throat> that's pretty much 11 prestiges not including prestige master which is I don't know if you want to count that 12, but at least 11 prestiges, and, uh, you know, I don't really want to do any more, I'm fine with 10, or, well, 11, that's good enough for me, but if they do uh, send them out, I will be prestiging, that is for sure, so, uh, yeah, talking about my score real quick in this game, the 34 and 1, we, got, we were facing some serious ass tryhards, and you're like, well, Chris, <laughs> There's not a chance these kids are trying that hard if you're 34 and 1. And I completely agree with you. And triple spray. Um, and don't get me wrong, you know, most of the time when I face tryhards in this game, I barely break even a lot. And that's why my KD isn't very high. But we're not going to sit here and make excuses for why my KD isn't high. Uh, just, you know, pretty much just because whenever we get into a tryhard game, I'm not a slayer anymore. Uh, Modern Warfare 3, I used to be the lead slayer for whenever I played, and, you know, I'd worry about my, you know, doing all the killing while my rest of my teammates did the OBJ. I don't do that anymore. I'm the guy, I'm the first one on the OBJ, and I'm the last person to die on it, too, you know what I mean? I don't stay there and leave. Uh, I'm a big OBJ player in this game. Unfortunately, this game doesn't really show up because it's um, one of my only games that I uh, go around slaying. <clears throat> but I would have to say that, uh, oh, check those leg spikes out. I would have to say that it is probably um, a lot easier to do well for the KD wise, maybe not the win loss because you do need people throwing their body on the objective and if your teammates aren't doing it, I'd say you're screwed. But the guys that are playing with were doing a pretty good job on the OBJ and if you look at the score right now, it doesn't look very close at all. So back to the point where I said these kids are really try hard. Uh, they all had like <clears throat> over 1.5 KDs to 2 KDs and they all had like 2 win losses. and. Uh, you're like, well, Chris, that doesn't make any sense. But uh, the only reason that I was doing so good was just because I was slaying. And these guys were huge on the objective. That's all they cared about. They didn't care about how many times they died. They were just trying to throw their body on it. And uh, I don't want to say that slaying won us the game, that's for sure. But it definitely made it a whole lot easier because the guys on the objective didn't have a whole lot of competition on it. <coughs> just strictly um, because of how, uh, how much I was dominating them on the kills. But, uh, yeah... Oh, what is today, guys? Today is December 16th now? Holy, uh, I think it's December 16th. Don't get, don't, uh, hold me to that. Might even be more than that. But, Christmas is coming up this year. Uh, I don't know. My parents keep asking me what I want for Christmas for a gift. I just keep saying I don't know. I don't care. I don't, 
As long as I get to spend time with my family, that's about all that counts, I guess you could say. Um, I'm not too worried about gifts anymore. There's nothing really in particular that I want this year. Uh, other than that, you know, just looking forward to Christmas, looking forward to getting the time off school, uh, you know, spending time with my family, just, you know, kicking back, relax, maybe play some Call of Duty during the break. I do get, like, a, a week and a half off or, like, two weeks off. I'm not sure how long it is. But, um, <laughs> you know, I'm looking forward to it. Um... I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do anything for Christmas uh, this year, considering, like, uh, Call of Duty-wise. I wanted to do, like, a series, but the series I had in mind, uh, Fear Crads kind of took it. And, um, I'm not, not that I can't do it myself, but, you know, I don't know. We'll see what we can do. Anyways, guys, final score, 34-1. and one. Not a bad game at all, but I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and uh, have a nice day, guys. Peace.